guys, how's it going? And welcome back to Justin's Tavern. As we're back out again with another brand new review just for you guys. We have McKellen's Islay Single Malt Scotch just for you guys. All right, so this is an amazing collection. I have had the Highland, the Islay, and the Lowland now. This is the third one I've tried. They do make a fourth one, um, the Space Side. I haven't got to try that one yet, but... Um, Really awesome box. I think they come in a beautiful, beautiful box every single time. Oh, that looks beautiful. A little darker than the rest. The other ones have been quite lighter than this one. So I'm really excited about it. So let's pour it up and then taste it and see what the box says. See if we can kind of guess it before they tell us. You know what I mean? Nah, I mean. Ooh, fresh. Crisp. Very beautiful color. Like I said, it's a little darker than the other ones. The other ones have been quite light. Ooh, definitely more smoky on this one. More like char, but kind of mellow. Vanilla, kind of. I'm trying to get the note. It's like a. Kind of like a chocolate smell, like a chocolatey vanilla-ish smell, but not bad. Kind of floral. Let's open it up. Oh wow! It's silky smooth, like really fine smooth. Um, it is very, very smoky. It kind of almost reminds me of the Johnny Walker. Uh, like a lighter version of the black or the double black. It kind of hangs on on the back back there really kind of densely. So that's not bad either. That's good. Really a, a smokier scotch. Definitely probably enjoyed more with like a, a steak or maybe like a cigar. But wow, it's, it's, that's dense. All right, so the box says this beautiful smoky single malt comes from the famous island of Islay, a full body drum with a taste of the sea. All right, and the sight of the golden honeyed spirit invites you on a journey. Then on the first breath, your destination is revealed. It's Islay, a nose full of beachside fires, and you're well on your way. One sip and you're there. The tang of the sea sweeps over you like the spray from an Atlantic roller. All that salt, all that smoke, all that peat, Yet no stage does the whiskey overwhelm. Now that it talks, it does kind of have like a sea salt kind of taste. Now that I hear it, I kind of I kind of get it. Um, its hearty nature is nicely balanced with a hint of vanilla and perhaps a little unexpectedly sharp slice of lemon. In the finish, sweet smoke and that unmistakable iodine, a sparkling gem of a drum from Islay. An island at the very edge of Scotland where high cliffs drop in the crashing surf and beautiful beaches thrill underfoot. This is Islay, for forged by nature, marked by history, made famous by a single malt whiskey. Uh, the Islay single malt is a singular expression of the remarkable isle. Um, it's just one of the discoveries that await you on a journey to the very heart of Scotland's most celebrated whiskey regions. Further taste adventures are just a sip away with our Highland, Lowland, Space Side, and Single Malts. So, like I've said, guys, we've had the Lowland, we've had the Highland. Yeah. Yeah, Lowland, the Highland, and we've had now the Islay. The only one we have not tried is the Space Side. Once I get the fourth one, we will have all the rings, and I will do a comparison of all four as well. But, this is really nice. I love how like smooth and silky it is. It lines the whole palate and really embodies the flavor. I love that. But cheers, awesome. Mm. They did a really great job with this one. I absolutely love it. I have yet to have a bad one of these and we are three for three. It just makes your mouth water and wanting more and it's just something that's just so desirable. Hey. 
Like, comment, subscribe. Remember, guys, I bias. You guys don't have to. I try. You guys don't have to. So, till later, till next time, till always. I'm Justin. Welcome to the tavern, and I can't wait to see you guys next time with another brand new review and live stream tomorrow, and a brand new short. As always, I love you, and I'll see you guys again next time.